What's up everybody, T3 here from Future Nature and T3 Photography. So I wanted to talk to you a little bit about my epic LT Right Genesis Scandi. Uh, but more importantly, I want to give you a good tip. And this is something I do with all of my knives. So we all know how important paracord is in a wilderness situation. So one thing I love about the way LT Wright does his sheaths is he's got holes here. So what I do with them is I take a big long length of paracord and do do find the end uh, and I pull it through here like this. Do do. do. So what I'm going to do is I am essentially going to wrap the sheath of this knife uh, in paracord. And why might you ask? Well, you know, why not? So what I'm going to do then is, as you can see here close, I'm just going to, you know, tight as I can, but not so tight to where I can't, uh, you know, readily access the blade, you know, pull the blade in and out of the sheath. I just kind of keep a, a good amount of tension on it down there. And I just wrap this. I'm just, for video's sake, I'm going to do it a bit quicker than I normally would. But, you know, I maintain tension. I don't want to let it go. Every once in a while, you could do like a crossover knot if you wanted to at the end. Um, but you don't have to. So anyway, you know, you get down, do, 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 okay. Just going to get all the way to the bottom here. Oh, I may have not even cut enough. Oh, no, I got plenty. Um, so yeah, so basically what I'm going to do is once I get down to the bottom, you know, I will then just, uh, you know, either put it through one of the holes, pull it out through the other, and then tie a couple of overhand knots and really pull them tight so that the cord stays tight on the sheet. Um, but yeah, there's a million different knots you could use to, to with these two holes right here. Or you could start at the bottom and work your way up to the top. But either or, are, you got yourself an epic tool made by an epic knife maker, LT Wright, and you got a whole bunch of paracord for bow drill strings, replacing shoelaces, uh, you know, using your silver emergency tarp to collect rainwater, you name it. So just another survival tip from T-Tree. See y'all later.